This government has tried to position itself as a friend of public sector workers. Yet, at every turn, they continue to ram through backroom decisions without any consultation that impacts the well-being of workers and their families. Since Friday, more than 53,000 PSAC members completed our survey about the government's mandate. The results are stark and strongly support all of the research about the benefits of telework on workers' productivity, job satisfaction, and work-life balance, and the harmful impacts of mass commuting on the environment. Rather than holding any consultation on telework, this government has thrown wrenches into the gears of our agreement, delaying the creation of these joint panels and stonewalling our approach to a case-by-case assessment. Workers feel betrayed, and we will be using every recourse we have available to fight this mandate and enforce a telework model that works for workers. So the hybrid model continues to exist. A hybrid working environment continues to exist. There is, for many people, a four-month transition period, and managers are going to be required to be in the office four days per week. And so all of that is within the jurisdiction of the Government of Canada, and it's executed by the departments. And I will say that a hybrid work environment is not within the collective agreements. It is something that, at the time of the negotiations, the Government of Canada retained prerogative over to determine the scope of the hybrid environment. What's clear is what the Liberal government is doing right now, what Justin Trudeau is effectively doing, is breaking an element of the collective agreement. This was a negotiated part of the agreement, and that's what should, be, should happen. These matters should be negotiated, and then the agreement should be respected. And what the Liberals are doing are, are disrespecting that agreement, are breaking an element of it, and of course the workers should be able to count on our support to stand with them, to apply pressure on the government to make sure they follow up and follow through with their word.